This video is about Plink. Plink is a free open source whole genome association analysis tool. It is developed by Dr. Sean Purcell at the Center for Human Genetic Research, Massachusetts General Hospital. It is purely based on the analysis of genotype and phenotype data. Plink is based on association mapping. Association mapping is also known as linkage disequilibrium mapping. It is a method of mapping quantitative trait loci. The association mapping has been most widely applied to the study of human disease. This study is based on the disc degenerative disease in human. It involves 58 SNPs, 35 candidate genes that were evaluated in 342 individuals. The genotyping of cases and controls was performed on genome-wide SNP array to identify potentially associated disease loci. The results from the genome-wide association study were then used to facilitate SNP selection. Downloading and working with Blink Plink is freely downloadable and the desired version can be downloaded by clicking on it. This is the PID file which contains the genotype data such as sex, age and the sequence. The entire data is generated and it is saved as text tab delimited form with the extension dot pid this is the map file that contains chromosome number snp id genetic distance and physical distance Likewise, the entire data are generated and it is saved in text tab delimited form with the extension dot map. The phenotype file contains family ID individual ID and seven phenotypes namely modic, disc bulge, annular tears, squalls, firman, scleraman and total endoplate score. Likewise, the entire phenotype file is generated and it is saved as text tab delimited form with the extension dot pino. In order to open the link workable area, enter into the jplink executable job file, click project open to set the directory of the folder in order to associate click blink Association and Alleric Association Tests. There are three work area in Blink. 
binary input, standard input, and alternate phenotype. Now enter into standard input in order to input the PID and MAP file. Now set the confidence interval as 0.95 and enter into the alternate phenotype and input the phenotype data. As we are going to associate the TEPS phenotype, give the column number in which the TEPS phenotype data is available. Now, give the output file name. Comma description is also the same as the output file name. Now the data are successfully associated. After associating, open the associated file in Excel sheet. This is the output file that contains chromosome, SMP identifier, physical position, minor allele name, frequency of allele in cases, frequency of allele in controls, major allele name, chi-square tests and asymptotic p-values. Now arrange the p-values in order to identify the significance level. Here the 5% significance level is identified. And the SMP related to the p-value is also identified. The results are interpreted using the list of candidate genes. Finally, it can be said that the phenotype TEPS is associated with the gene ADAMTS5 with SNP ID RS2249350 at chromosome 21 with p-value 0.01474 at 5% significance. It can be concluded that the presence of the gene ADAMTS5 leads to disc regeneration in human. In the software window, go to Plink format and Input the associated file, that is the output file, and also the map file. Click OK. Now select the gene associated from the list obtained and click the option Go to Selected Region. A new window is obtained in which we need to click go to region. Now we are getting connected to the International Human HapMap Project Server.
from the half map data we get the location of the snip that is the highlighted row that gives the information about location position names alleles etc in order to view the location of the smp on the chromosome we need to click ld plot there we can view the location of the gene The exact location of the SMP RS2249350 is on 27244 base pair that is highlighted in green. Also the SMP RS162500 is highlighted as it behaves same like our associated gene. The gene is located on chromosome 21 and Our SMP is located in fifth block and it is 68 kb of size. Thus, the location of the SMP is found.